Good day everyone, and so for today, we're gonna talk about Technology Collaborative Tools in the Digital World The lesson outcomes is Identified and explored collaborative tools or applications that can be integrated instructions ICT transforms collaboration and open opportunities for interaction. Smartphones and virtual meeting spaces transform the way people collaborate and open up countless opportunities for interactions unhindered by time and location constraints. Technology as a collaborative tool. One way to engage students is to give them a challenge and chance to work them together. Students may continue the discussion and share information or come up with an agreement by texting, emailing, chatting, or using the online document. Collaboration with the students and teamwork can generate numerous benefits. It can improve creativity, faster execution of ideas, have a sense of teamwork, and faster problem solving. They can continue to discuss and share information through some social media sites like Facebook, Instagram, Messenger, Twitter, and they can communicate through those media sites. Technology has gone through to the world, especially to this time which we need to use our devices in order for us to go to class, especially to us students. And so we can communicate with our classmates and teachers about the topics or lessons that we have. When you have to need to collaborate with your group mates, you must communicate with them and what will be the things you will do in order to have a good presentation. The learners in today's generations have a new kind of breed. They are up to some technological aspect which they only have to use their gadgets in order to communicate. They are much more to connect in social media than they are in the classroom. Tools and applications that can be used to work collaboratively with others. And here are some examples. Skype. Skype is a software application allowing you to do a video conference for free. It is a computer program which you can use to make voice calls or video calls on the internet. It is so useful especially if you have friends, classmates, or loved ones which are far away. This is Wiki. Wiki is a software that allows you to create a pages designed to follow you to post or write edit and upload a link where it can be extended virtually and asynchronously it is an online encyclopedia and it is the most popular wiki based website and one of the most widely viewed sites in the world blogging blogging it is journalizing your ideas to which others can react allowing a thread of discussion to take place and which can be used online. It is the abbreviation of weblog. It refers to writing photography and other media that self-published online. It is a content creation and shares on social media. You can share your knowledge, experiences, or the latest news creates a unique and beautiful blog for free. Next, it would help if you provide direction when using a web blog. Using a web blog with a clear instructional objective, guidance on what and how to post will be needed. With easy access to information, a major obligation is to teach the students to use multiple sources and to cite them appropriately. Writing about your idea is a personal act, but it is important that you are taught to make blogs personal without revealing too much of personal information, information such as contact information and too, too much personal pictures. 
it may help if you can look very good example blogs. Next is Google Maps or Google Forms. It is an application that can be used in a collaborative document of ideas contributed by members of the team. Google Maps is a web-based service that provides detailed information about geographical regions and sites around the world. Google Form is free online software that allows you to create surveys, quizzes, as well as to collaboratively edit and share the information with other people. I have gathered data from millennials by asking 20 respondents on how they want to learn. 10% is by reading the textbook. 35% is by listening to the teacher. 10% is surfing the internet. 25% is by taking down notes. 20% taking down notes by listening to the teacher. So the overall is here. And millennials are much more easy to learn by listening to the teacher. Collaboration technology helps expand access to education, with its schools have the ability to reach more students. Using video online instruction can be as effective as traditional face-to-face -face tradition. Collaborative learning models are transforming the way educators teach and students engage.